All right, welcome to Super Fans. I'm Samantha. This I'm is Kelly. Kelly, and today <laughs> we are going to talk about our tattoos and their meanings. Yeah. Okay, you go first. Well, the first tattoo I was, I got when I was 18. My bad Tinkerbell. My bad Tinkerbell. I do love it. She's it, sassy. Yeah. <laughs> It was a backyard job, and you like my first tattoo. Yeah, <laughs> well, I do like yours. Yeah, it goes all right. Um, is that it about Tink? No, nah, I got it because yeah, I love Tinkerbell. She's awesome. She is pretty badass. Alrighty, um, my first tattoo was Jack Skellington, just the skull, um, and I got it uh, when I was seventeen just before I turned 18 as like a birthday present, like a week or two before my birthday. Um, yeah, I got it because uh, The Nightmare Before Christmas is one of my favorite movies of all time, but Jack Skellington is just awesome. <laughs> yes. Okay, my it's second tattoo is my red dragon. I name a ruby. I like it. Um, it was a birthday present. Can't remember what age I turned, but it was a birthday present. <laughs> birthday present. It was also another backyard job. Mm -hmm. And you already know, I love dragons. That's why I got it. Yeah. Why not? Dragons are awesome. All right. Um, my second tattoo was a professional one because um, Jack was my only backyard job or home job one. Um, I got my daughter's name um, with an old fashioned key with a red rose wrapped around it because her middle name is Rose and yep okay that one will come up my third one is my wolf I absolutely love this one because it wasn't in the original design but afterwards I noticed it was smirking and it looks like it's winking too it is? you don't see it but no, I, I see, see it I, I see the like smirk it's going like this yeah it was a professional job and yeah I just fell in love with the picture, so I had to get it. Yeah. And it sort of reminds me of my second child, Ashlyn. Yeah. She's, it's got yeah. her all over it. It does. Um, I have a bit more than Callie, so yeah. but I'm going to just She's going to take over. Yeah. All right. <laughs> um, my third one is a raven on a block with a clock. <laughs> Sounds so funny. This, this one here, it's going to come up in a picture. Um, I wasn't intentionally going to get that one. I was actually going to get um, Snow White. And in the last week, because I had my tattoo booked in for a couple of months, but in the last week I was like, I don't want Snow White anymore. I want this one, <laughs> which is really odd for me to do. But no, it's not really because I do that all the time. Um, I got it because I like the artist's work. It also appears as an album cover for In Flames, and I didn't get it because I'm a crazy In Flames fan. I do like their work, but I got it because um, the artist's work is amazing, and he was on an episode of LA Inc. with Kat Von D. Cool. Yes, in like the first season or something. Um, I have a purple and green rose with Nen P written underneath it because um, it was my mother's mother who passed away from cancer but I because I knew that she was dying I got it done before she died so she could see it um, and yeah she um, it's not really a big fan of tattoos but she loved it she was she was like everyone come see Sam's tattoo come see it it's awesome <laughs> yeah um, and then my last one is Nevermore, which is written above my raven, and I got that for the Edgar Allan Poe's uh, poem, Nevermore, like the raven. It's above my raven, so yeah, it yeah. all works into one. Yeah, all of mine are on my back. Yeah. <laughs> not to mention that. Yeah, um, I got one on my leg, one on my ankle, Jack's leg, on um, top of this leg, uh, Kendra's name is on this ankle, and the rest of them are up this arm. I'm going to my next one here. Talk about your next one. My next future one. Future tattoos. Yeah, future tattoos. Yeah, I'm looking forward to this one. Yeah. Oh. Because you designed one's, it. Yeah, I'm designing it at the moment. I haven't finished it. But to start off with, I'll be getting a snowflake. I'll be doing um, the seasons in my favourite order. 
Yeah, yeah. Which will be winter, autumn, spring, then summer. Summer's my least favourite too. <laughs> it's way too hot. Yes. <clears throat> and I am, she has started on it and I am loving it so far. It looks I've amazing. I've misplaced it at the moment, but yes. I will find it and I'll put a picture up on Facebook. Or something. Yes, yeah, something. Um, my next tattoo, it's because I'm getting this one next because it'll be the easiest and the cheapest one to do. I'm getting um, a white tulip from um, Fringe, the one that... Um, time jumper guy gave to Walter Bishop because he wanted a sign um, and the meaning for me is going to be anything's possible because he um, if you've seen the episode you'll understand um, it's it's weird because he wanted a sign from God to tell whether to tell Peter um, about him being from the other universe it's really complicated <laughs> but yeah um but the meaning for me is that anything's possible and so that's why i'm getting it done okay we've gone through them all yep let's so, see so till next time bye, bye.